the YouTubers. Hello to all our subscribers. Thank you for everyone who's subscribed so far. Uh, channel's growing brilliantly. Thank you. And if you're watching this and haven't subscribed, then why not? It's free. Please subscribe and support the channel. This video is about modifications we've made to our motorhome, things that we've added or changed to make our motorhome uh, more enjoyable, easier to use, uh, more functional and more prettier. You know, so I've added Jess. Uh, she's added a lot of value to the motorhome, I have to admit, uh, and does all the work. And this is a collaboration video. So please take the time to check out all our friends' video below. I'll put in the comments there uh, the links to all their channels. So please go and check their videos out. And these are... The Hills on Tour, Made by Hedgehogs, Meandering Manx, Wandering Wilds, What's Occurring, Ladies Go Camping and The Dream Chasers. And what I'll do is I'll put all their logos over Jess's face. <laughs> so, which are, their logos are prettier than Jess's face. Oh, wow. So, what did we add to Millie that's made her more in more enjoyable, more, more functional helpful, as well. more functional? That's a good word. That's a good word. More keep functional. That. We'll keep that word in. Functional. <laughs> I'll edit it to make it sound like I've said it. These are the things we've added to make Millie more functional, and I'll just edit <laughs> out the whole bit where uh, go Jess, to outside. Yeah, just made the, the the suggestion. So, first one, we painted her. <laughs> we did. That didn't make it more functional. Made it more pretty, though. Made it beautiful. Yeah, it had. It is really kind of spruced her up a bit. Wished I'd done it sooner. I kept on putting it off and putting it off, and we were kind of busy using her during the summer, so we yeah. didn't really have a lot of time, and it did take a long time. And now was the time, wasn't it? Yeah, because we, we didn't plan to go anywhere. The weather's changed, so it was the right time to do the painting. So I'm kind of glad we did. Bear in mind, last winter, she spent most of the time in the garage getting welded, so we didn't have much time. Uh, but it has made a massive difference and didn't cost a huge amount. I think, what would I say, the whole budget, including pounds. all the curtains, the cushion covers and everything was £200. So the paint was less than £100. So the second one we added was the Sheen cushion covers. Very cheap, very easy to fit. They're very stretchy. Yeah, they're not perfect. We could have paid to get them recovered, etc. But that was going to be really expensive. I think, I mean, I was, it was a few hundred pounds probably more and that was mate's rate uh the cushion covers all the cushions and the cushion covers was well under 100 quid i think it was 80 pounds in total uh one of them things where you think they're just too cheap there is a separate video that covers the cushions and the sponge as well we redesigned the cushions slightly because there was a it was a bit of a jigsaw the cushions that came with millie were not the original cushions i don't think so they never quite perfectly fitted so we kind of got some sponge cut uh, replaced some of the cushions, took the other cushions away, decluttered it, and I think it's made a huge difference. Again, you know, if all you're going to do is just cover your cushions, they come off, they're washable, uh, and it protects the old cushions. So, good quality. Yeah, and for the price, oh, like I say, I'm really impressed. There's a separate video if you're really interested on that, uh, but we really enjoyed that. Was a so the third one was one of the first things I think I changed on on Millie when I got. Millie early last or late last year getting colour gas uh, cans was really difficult uh, and then I ended up getting two so but getting them refilled was going to be really problem because you don't get them refilled what you do is you swap them out and all the places locally didn't have any of the 14 kilograms uh, bottles for Millie so I saw a YouTube channel and not many people have done this but I swapped out the standard colour gas bottles for the home base gas light barbecue bottles. And it's perfectly safe. They're see-through, so you can see how much gas you've got. And one of my biggest worries is going away, not having it, running out of gas. You know, you put your kettle on and you've run out of gas. It's very hard to tell how much gas you've got left in the metal bottles. And, you know, I think it's probably a little bit more than a colour gas bottle, but easier available. Most home bases have got them. And I think it's made a big difference. And we, we didn't, I haven't used a huge amount of gas anyway. But the bottle has made a big difference. And it wasn't, again, a very cheap modification that made our lives slightly easier. What's the next one? Oh, pop-up tables. Oh, pop-up tables. One was bought from, from eBay. Mm -hmm. And the other one was kind of made from a chopping board. Uh, and we'll put some B-rolls in and we'll kind of talk about it. But they have made 
a huge amount of difference because it's added to the kitchen space as well as coffee. We took the main table out. We were finding that we weren't using the table in Millie yeah, at all. It's just in the way. Yeah. And what we'd end up doing was when we were getting to site, we were just taking it down anyway. <coughs> so, and there was something to store. So we just stopped taking it with us, and but also, we needed somewhere to put the cups. We and... always eat outside, don't we? So we yeah. only need the surfaces for chopping things and then putting cups on. Yeah. And the other thing we added was a thermal door curtain, which made a huge <laughs> difference. When we first went away in Millie last winter, there was a massive draft. It was very cold Easy. inside Millie, even with the heater on, the radiators, the fan heaters. And Millie's door doesn't fit properly anyway because she's old and battered and, you know, knackered. Uh, but the thermal door curtain, again, from Amazon, I'll put all these links below, uh, made a huge difference. And again, very cheap. I think it's, I think they were like £16, £18, round about the £20 mark. Uh, and it, it made a massive difference. And what we've done is we've got a different colour one because the one I bought was red. And we've kind of gone grey, uh, but I've decided to go black with the the curtain, the, the the door curtain, and made a huge difference. Again, very small costs, but makes huge difference to the motorhome. So next thing we added was cupboard lights. Again, these are really cheap, and they've got multiple different versions. But you know, they're motion sensors. They just either screw in or stick in with 3M sticky pads. We put a few in the overhead cupboards, uh, one in the cupboards there. And when you open the cupboard, they light and they just put a bit of light inside the cupboard. Makes getting things out of the cupboard so much easier. And again, very small cost, but makes a huge difference. Now you're opening, no more rummaging through dark cupboards. It lights up the whole cupboard and they're brilliant, really well worth the extra money. And the magnetic, magnetic tie back clips or DK hoops. Top tip. Yeah, so this is, I think this is my design. Uh, <laughs> basically what they are, they're, they're ring magnets with a screw through the center of it. And what I've done is I've put them in already existing screws, holes, uh, and you get a disc magnet and they just keep the curtains in place. And, you know, I think that's made a huge difference, a huge difference. And uh, yeah, and again, makes our life so much easier. There's no faffing around. And also when you're driving, it stops the curtains from opening. And with the new curtains that we've got from Amazon, they come back, come with Velcro uh, tie backs for three pound for a pair. Uh, and they're brilliant as well. So I'm gonna order some more of them and fit them to Millie. Anything else we've added? Of course, we've got to add a Jess. <laughs> but Jess is quite expensive. So it's very, very expensive. Very, the, uh, oh, high maintenance. Very high maintenance. <laughs> and of course, a kettle and a toaster. That always makes a big difference. Oh, the other thing we did is, so we've got, windscreen covers mm. like a, a, a it's, it's a cheap and we should really invest in in the the silver ones the thermal ones but at a hundred and something pounds they're quite expensive so i've got kind of like a cheap one doesn't fit perfectly but you've seen it in the videos uh it just wraps around clips on the door but we noticed that there was still a draft coming in from the front of the cab so we have a curtain pole just a normal standard curtain pole and we've got a very thick velvet curtain that came with Millie, to be honest, but there wasn't a curtain pole, so we fitted a curtain pole and we've used that thick curtain. Uh, and it does, again, yeah. keeps the actual sleeping area or the living quarters, because Millie's huge, <laughs> the, uh, west the west wing and the library. It, it just makes things <laughs> a lot warmer, doesn't it? It makes it a lot yeah. more toastier. And again, Stops very low me cost. Moaning. Jess, you never moan. Have you moaning. ever heard anybody who's watched the video of us camping in minus one or two degrees? I didn't moan. No, did I? Watch the video. Didn't moan. Did she not moan? Did not moan. Did she not moan? Did she not moan? No, because she had like 12 layers of clothing <laughs> on. Uh, but I think that was prior to putting the door curtain, the, the, yeah, the running that curtain was the up. First night, yeah, it? so we've met, we've learned a lot by going out in the cold. And of course, we've never used it because <laughs> we've been camping in the summer. And now we're going back into another winter. Uh, again, it was a great value add. So and it means we can get out, doesn't it? Yes. Well worth it. Again, all these are very low costs. I mean, we talk about the solar panel, uh, which was one of the first things that I fitted. That's a huge modification. Uh, yeah, but I wouldn't say that was a cheap <coughs> modification. Mm. Uh, but it does make a huge difference. We do go do a lot of off-gridding, uh, but we don't use a huge amount of electricity, to be honest. So, but then it saved us money, is not it? Because we've not had to pay for sites. Yes, so. it has enabled us to go off-grid a lot more. 
It also means we never have to worry about our leisure batteries because even though it's only 100 watts, we don't use a huge amount of, of battery power anyway. That's perfectly enough for us for the lights, for recharging our, our laptops. We've got the power bank anyway, which is more of a purchase than a modification. But I think the there's a complete video on, on fitting it. Uh, <clears throat> I'm not sure I would have paid the full price to fit the, the solar panels, but it does help us. It enables us to use the Wi-Fi when we're away with the kids, and it, and it means we never worry about lights or anything like that. But that's only really we we use it for. Uh, we don't use a huge amount of power when we're off-grid because we're used to camping. So, well, I'm used to camping. Jess is just learning to love camping. <laughs> when I first met her, she swore she would never even go into a caravan, and now I've got her into a tent. <coughs> so that's it. Uh, don't forget, this is a collaboration video, so please spend some time going check out the other videos. We tend to do things slightly different, so it's very interesting to watch what the and other channels have done. Yeah, or different vans. There's some uh, van builds uh, videos in the collaboration, some really nice, beautiful motorhomes in the collaboration group. So we're all different channels. Please go and subscribe to them as well. But subscribe to us first. Yes. <laughs> and then uh, check their videos out as well. Put a like as well. That thumbs up always helps the channel. And put some comments. Don't forget, how many cushions should we have in Millie? Three or five. Five? We can have five. <coughs> Why did they sell them in pairs? And we need coasters. What else do we need? Lots of things. Oh, I do like you need lots of things. We're going shopping. We're going shopping yeah. for a few little pretty things to add to Millie. And it is. It's starting to milk. Amazing. And, you know, and we've got a drone. Can't wait. <laughs> Can't wait to play with the drone. Anyway, catch you later, guys. Don't forget, like, subscribe. You know, everyone says Jess never gets a word in Edgeway, so what do you want to talk about? Anyway, thanks a lot. <laughs> oh. <coughs> I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. <laughs> Comment below, sympathy, you know, any cures you've got for uh, the common so cold. It cold. might be your last video. Man it's alright, it'll be me. Man cold. Man cold, I'm not well. Hashtag Team Jess. Bye bye, darling. Yeah, it might just be Jess's team. Yeah, it might just be it. Jess's video. Yeah. I'll have to, like, change the logo and everything. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, and if you do want any merch, then let me know and I'll put the link onto it. And if you do think Darren should change the logo. Oh, no. Yes. Oh. If anybody wants to pay for me to change my logo, <laughs> can't afford it. I've just uh, paid we said, we said several hundred years. pounds. It's got to... six months. Yeah. No. That was a deal. No. That was a deal. No. I'm pretty sure I tell the you, these people were there when this was negotiated. Look how much they've had to pay. They've changed their van and well, they've had to change their go. logo. That's love, isn't it? I'd well done, darling. I'd rather be well single. Done. I'd rather stay. I'd rather be <laughs> single and save. That's how tight I am. I'd rather be single and not spend any money on the on the logo. Anyway, anyone thinks I'm tight. Anyway, <laughs> we've waffled on for about 10, 15 minutes. We're having fun. You've probably all stopped watching this now. <laughs> no one's watching this video at all. Anyway, yeah, click subscribe, blah, blah, blah. You do that big one. Too. Tell them to subscribe. Subscribe, please. Was that it? And can you do hashtag Team Jess? And can I go on the logo? Hi. <laughs> Thanks. Burn the face. One job. <laughs> so when he has to press record <laughs> the table the table <laughs>